Finally, we have the last member of the Son of Kaladin drip marketing, Lighter. He appears to be a fire stunner character, and although we don't yet know what weapon he'll use or his exact rarity, rumors suggest he could be a five-star character. For now, all we can do is wait and hope for more details to be revealed soon. Interestingly, Lighter is the only male character in the Son of Kaladin faction, which gives the team a bit of a harem dynamic. <laughs> Now, as we know, there are currently only four stunners in the game, with many players considering Ching Yi to be the best. But with Lighter joining the roster, the big question arises. Will Lighter surpass Ching Yi and take the top spot as the best stunner? While we don't have any concrete answers yet, it's definitely exciting to see what Hoyoverse has in store for Lighter's kit and how he might shake up the meta. Moreover, with Lighter's arrival, Son of Caledon becomes the only faction without a dedicated DPS character. This is quite amusing especially given how fierce and brutal the Son of Kaladin are known to be in battle. This unique lineup adds an intriguing twist to the faction's dynamic. Additionally, Son of Kaladin is now the first faction to have more than four playable characters, which further shows how much attention Hoyoverse is giving them. And that brings us to all we know about Lighter so far. With such limited information, we can only speculate that he will be a great fit for a mono fire team, likely complementing Soldier 11 as the DPS. His role as a fire stunner could provide excellent synergy, enhancing the team's damage output while controlling the battlefield. While we await more details, it's safe to say that Lighter has the potential to add exciting new dynamics to fire-based team compositions.